motivated me to help with a few other people found something called the Association for Spiritual Integrity, which is at spiritual-integrity.org. Um, not as a policing body of any kind, because we don't have that sort of authority, but just as a an uh, articulation or uh, of what should be considered appropriate in a spiritual community or from a spiritual teacher so that people don't doubt their own sensibilities when they, they see a teacher misbehaving and then, then they begin to think, well, he's supposed to be enlightened and I'm not, so maybe this, this is okay or maybe this is crazy wisdom or something. Because that kind of stuff is, has really hurt a lot of people. And I think it really needs to be cleaned up and continue to be observed or, or you know, corrected in order for the whole spiritual enterprise to be maximally beneficial for individuals and the world.